Hollywood's glitterati turn against the owner of the famed Beverly Hills Hotel. US TV celebrity Jay Leno and his wife joined women's and gay rights groups in calling for a boycott of the iconic hotel. These protests come after the hotel's owner, the Sultan of Brunei, ushered in Sharia law last week. The strict Islamic law has a penal code which includes punishments such as the severing of limbs for theft and death by stoning for adultery, sodomy and rape. But I'd like to think that all people are basically good and when they realize this is going on, hopefully they will do something about it. I mean, this is not, you know, there's nothing extreme happening here. These aren't, oh, crazy feminist wackos. They're women who, who just try to protect other women. And gay people protecting other gay, I mean, it just, I don't know, Berlin, 1933, hello. I mean, just does it seem that far off from what happened during the Holocaust? The Beverly Hills Hotel and the Hotel Bel Air are part of the Dorchester collection of properties owned by the Brunei Investment Agency, an arm of the Brunei government. You no, know, there's other hotel companies in the city that are owned by Saudi Arabia. There's, you know, if you take the investment that comes into Harvard University, um, you know, your shirt is probably comes from a country which has uh, uh, human rights uh, issues. So, uh, again, to single out the uh, uh, Beverly Hills Hotel, the Dorchester Collection, particularly our employees, I fear is, uh, feel is very unjust. The tiny state on the island of Borneo is ruled by Sultan Hazanal Bolkia and has grown rich in oil and gas exports.